let's combine a couple of features. Let's combine the suppress feature as well as the multiple sections feature. Now I have made a connection to my backend database and I have employee and employee address. Now in the details section I'm actually going to right click and I'm going to do another section within here. So insert a section below and I'm going to do that a couple of times. Now in the A details I'm just going to bring in the employee's first name and the employee's last name and I'm going to get rid of the information in the page header. Now in the details B I'm going to get address 1 and then address 2 in the C and city in the D section plus region and I'm going to right click insert another section I'm going to put country in the bottom and then postal code. Now let's preview. Okay. Now there is a lot of spacing that's odd here because all of my details are very close together in here. So let's make the address portions a little bit deeper. And let's preview. Now you can easily see there's some blank sections in here. Hmm. That's a problem. And it's address too. So over off to the left hand side we're going to right click and what we're going to do is go into this sections expert. And for detail C suppress if it is blank. So right there and let's preview. That looks better. Now we're going to go back and we're going to add another section. Now this section we're actually just going to put a line in here. And let's preview so that we can actually see the end of the address block. And we go back and we're going to do another section. Now in this other section, which is our section G, we're going to put a text object. Now with the text object still accessible, we're going to bring in the employee's first name right in there. And then a comma and I have to move this around a little bit and I'm going to size that up just a little bit and another text box and we're going to bring in the hire date. Now we're going to format that field because we actually want it to show as a regular date field. So based on the hire date of Isn't that nice? Gets four weeks vacation. Now let's have a look at this. This date, four weeks of vacation. But what we actually want to do is have a new page after every single block of text. So we want after detail G. So we right click and let's go into the section expert and print at bottom read only. Now notice there's a paging. 
So do we want a new page before or after? We want a new page after. And let's preview. And there's the first one. And there's the second one. So we can build emails. We can build mass mailing through our crystal reports. And we can suppress sections based upon what is necessary. And that's the end of this demo.